Hey, sweetness. How's it going? It's a beautiful day out, so I was thinking we could head out for a spontaneous date or something. We could go for a walk in the park. We haven't done that in a while. Or if you want, we could go somewhere a little further. It is the perfect weather to go to the beach. What do you say? Hmm? What's up? Sweetness, are you being a lazy bum? All up on the couch like that? Here, let me sit next to you. You look so cozy under that blanket. I guess you're not in the mood to go out right now, huh? Nah, it's okay. I'd rather just stay here with you. Just, you know, hang out. Maybe watch a movie? Or binge a new show together then? We could try cooking dinner together as well. Just gotta figure out what we can make with things already in the fridge though. H hey are you okay? What's wrong? You just winced just now. Uh oh it it's that time of the month. I see. When did you start getting it? Just today, huh? It's been a while since your last one, so I assume this one must be a pretty bad one. Yeah, I thought so. You've always said that when you miss your period for a little bit, it returns stronger and worse than before. Aw, oh, I'm sorry, sweetness. Is there anything I can do to help you? Hmm. Okay. Uh, let me get your heating pad and bring it to you. Just stay there, okay? Here, I got you your heating pad. Be careful with the temperature though, okay? I thought it'd be a good idea to get a water bottle and some meds as well. Uh, assuming you hadn't taken some already. You can take some Advil. Here. Uh, two should be enough, right? Now, before you take the Advil, have you eaten anything yet? No. Sweetness, that's not good for you. The meds could just upset your stomach if you don't eat something first. Oh, I know. You don't have much of an appetite when you get cramps, but at least try to eat something. It doesn't have to be anything heavy. It can just be cookies or something. It's actually pretty convenient that we have this cookie jar right here. Here, have a cookie or two at least before you take the meds. Good girl. Go on. You can take the Advil now. You know I'm just trying to make sure that you feel as comfortable as possible through this. I remember the last time you had some really bad cramps. It was my first time dealing with that, so I had no idea what to do. I just stood there. I never want to see you go through that again. So I did some research on my own and learned a thing or two online. I learned the rest from you, of course. I know that the experience can be different from person to person, but I think I've been around you long enough to sort of know what works and what doesn't. For example, I learned that you particularly enjoy tummy rubs. Is that right? Ah, so you do. Well, if it helps ease the pain a little, and if you like it, then I'll give you some cuddles and tummy rubs, okay? Let me just... <clears throat> cuddle next to you, like this. And you can just nuzzle onto me if you want. In this position, I can give you all the tummy rubs you want. How is it? Is it better or worse? Better. Okay. Then we can stay like this for a while longer then. Don't worry about it. We can stay here for as long as you need to. There's nothing to apologize about. None of this is your fault. This is just a normal occurrence. Though I wish it didn't bring you so much pain. It is normal. 
It happens, and you have no control over it. So, please don't apologize. You're in pain, and naturally I would be there for the person I love. And that would be you, sweetness. I'd be a pretty bad boyfriend if I wasn't, right? So, don't question why I'd be willing to take care of my beautiful girlfriend. Hey, it doesn't mean that because you're in your period, you're not beautiful, okay? Yeah, to me, you look gorgeous. You're incredibly pretty, and you should know this. Yes, you are! <laughs> hey, come on, don't hide your face on my chest. I want to look at you more, and just be hypnotized by your beauty. <laughs> hey, are you getting all flustered because of the sudden influx of compliments? Bad luck for you, it isn't over yet, sweetness. I have plenty of compliments stocked up for you. Well, uh, you know, I like your mannerisms. Like, I find it so cute when you get flustered and hide your face in any way you can. Whether that's by hiding your face in your hands, or by snuggling up to my chest like what you're doing right now. I also love your smile and your laugh, especially whenever I say some stupid pun, because no one else would laugh at them. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll hold off on the compliments for now. Uh, actually, maybe just one more. <laughs> I love you. Yeah, I know you know, but I just wanted to say it again. I love you. Mm-hmm, I love you, no matter what state you're in. <laughs> yeah, even when you're bleeding. Uh-huh, even when you get angry at me for no reason. Even when you're grumpy because you feel bloated. And with your hormones being all wacky, that your face is just about to break out. Every time I look at you, I still go, Damn, I love you so much. Mm-hmm. It's gonna take a lot more than blood to scare me away, okay? So, how are you feeling now? Is it a little better at least? That's good to know, sweetness. Uh, how about we watch a movie? Or watch a new show for the rest of the afternoon? Then, once it's evening, I'll cook you dinner, and we can enjoy it together. Mm hmm. Are you interested in ice cream by any chance? You are? Well, that's good because I recently restocked the ice cream. So we can have that for dessert. How does that sound? <laughs> you want them now? Gosh, a little impatient, but. Okay, sweetness. I'll hand you the remote and you can choose something for us to watch. In the meantime, I'll go grab us some ice cream, and once I'm back, we can just vibe and watch something. You cool with that? Cool beans. Let me just get up and grab the remote then. Yeah, sorry, but the tummy rubs will have to be paused until I return. Here's the remote. I'll go get the ice cream then, and yeah, I'll be back. Uh huh? What was that, sweetness? Ah, uh, you're welcome, and I love you too.